blunder. Blunderbuss. Yep, here you go. What? Well, this is yours. Oh, I do. Drive. No. Pause it for a second. Alright, let's see. How do I run? So I'm assuming this is my house. Or am I interrogating no. more people? You're interrogating more people. Pretty much, Shelby just goes around and talks to people that uh, have been oh, victims of the Oregon Killer. I'm assuming everything adds up eventually. Mm -hmm. No answer. Baby screaming inside. Not a promising start. <laughs> Mom could be asleep. See, I always like in video games when it rains, and since it's always raining in this game, I, I really like that. You could look in the windows and stuff. I think? No, I guess not. Shelby Commander. <laughs> what does he command? <laughs> inhalers. The of inhalers. <laughs> Shelby Commander. Baby. Baby Commander. You should, uh, baby bend. Excuse me, I have to go air sit, I mean baby bend. I think the baby wrote you a note. This is balls. That is definitely hey, wrote, written as bowels. Mrs. Bowels, how are your bowels doing? You almost made me just spit up my drink. <sighs> Take care of my bakery? Take care of my baby. Oh. I'd rather take care of a bakery. Hello, Hello oh, little cutie. cutie. No? You're looking for your mama. Too bad. Oh, so cute. Oh, that's so cute. Bye bye. Mosquito cookies. No, assorted cookies. Oh, the textures haven't popped in yet. What would a mosquito cookie taste like? Don't knock on the door or anything. No, oh, I'm assuming she's either run away or killed herself. One of the two. Mm. Or both. They have two really tiny TVs in this house. That's really odd to me. Yeah, I'm not used to seeing like tiny ass TVs. Yeah. We live in the 21st century. Mr. Bowles, are you there? What if she's taking a shit? <laughs> Ketchup on the tub. Mrs. Bowles! Mrs. Bowles, can you hear me? Wake up! She's Wake dead. up! Dave. I'm assuming that that dress was at one point white. Um, I'm assuming that this guy has never taken a forensics class in his fucking life. He's lost a load of blood. Why? Lucky I happened to be on the scene. Yeah. Like, uh, assuming she's dead. Like, you don't move the body from the, uh, no, I, from the scene. I don't want to go to the hospital. Oh, okay, she's Please. Alive. Okay. You got something around here I can dress this one with? Yeah. I think so. Why are you cooperating? Okay, you just tried move. killing yourself. I'll be right back. Um, suicide remorse, I guess. Which I'm just gonna assume is a thing. I'm assuming you're gonna come back and she's dead. <laughs> yeah, she just dies. No, she finishes it herself off. You come back and the baby's dead. All right, I'll dress you with the baby. <laughs> this will cauterize the wounds. <laughs> and then you baby bend. <laughs> You can't have blood in your hands. He would literally be caught red-handed. Well, you know that's what that comes from, right? Yes. <laughs> yeah. Where can I cauterize these wounds? Use the cookies. There's something on the table you can interact with. 
You should have the cookies. Okay. Well, literally, it was just the cookies. This is the cookies. The cookie. Put that cookie down! No! Oh, go to the bathroom, duh. No. Metal Gear. Metal Gear. Metal Gear. Metal Gear. Metal Gear. What is that alarm for? Trivia. Oh! Let's see. I need this, and this, and this. Look <laughs> at <laughs> <laughs> the way he walks. Please tell me she's dead. Nope. I'm here for you, Susan. You'll be all right. No, don't fuck this up. I'll take care of you. Why are you giving me the tough shit? <laughs> I don't know. I'll do the next tough thing. I figured you'd want to do stay something. Me, Susan. Susan, do you hear me? Is that salt? Susan, stay you with me. You about to salt her wounds? Do you hear me? Mind. Stay with me. You're clearly not doing anything. I just put a band-aid on it. There, I done what I can. That should stop the bleeding. Well, luckily the wounds aren't too deep. Hey, how are you feeling? Okay. I just tried to kill myself, asshole. My baby. My baby needs me. Right. You stay there. I'll take care of the baby. Okay? Do you know what to do? With a baby, I mean. I'm a private eye. There's nothing I can't do. It's all murders. <laughs> Not very good at that part. <laughs> Still working. Yeah. Gotcha. But damn it, if I can't take care of a baby. <laughs> uh, that's funny. <laughs> nope, apparently I can't walk towards a fucking baby. No, that way. Thank you. Come here, I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. Uh, now I have to wash my hands. Fuck you. But you already did that. Your hands should just always be washed. <laughs> Forever. Constant sink following me. See, I know why they're doing this. Because you didn't wash your hands when you when you peed. Shut up. Who washes their hands before they take a shower? Hi there, Emily. <laughs> that character obviously... How do you know the baby's name? Because you told her. Oh. Oh. Going by the smell. You have to change the pretty good idea. This is going to be amazingly boring-ish fun. It's gonna be one of those three. Okay. How do you do this again? Hmm? Of course, they have to go with the cliche now, right? Oh, baby, pooped herself. Hmm. If you look closely, there, his hand clipped through the the baby's butt, and the. Uh, it looked like his, his finger was coming out of the baby's butt. That was a little weird. That's a kind of no, cute baby, no, I guess. Not the right way. Okay. <clears throat> Let's start again. He's a bane bee. No. Right. You keep doing it the wrong way. No. Meh, I'm Betty. Meh. There you go. There you Fresh go. New baby. Fresh, Fresh new baby. baby. Fresh new baby. It's got that new baby smell. Right, Emily? Hmm? Hey, what's the matter? I I'm was hungry. See, this is how I would talk to babies. I wouldn't be like, oh, who is your baby? I'd be like, what the fuck's your problem, kid? Why are you yelling? And that's why I'll never hungry. be a dad. No, but I so totally would act like it. What's the problem? I thought we solved this. Yeah. I thought we were done here. Come on! I guess I better warm this thing up. Light it on fire. Oh. What? I just light it on fire. Of course you would. I'd be the best dad. I guess this is technically a bad, a good dad simulator? Good private eye. There's nothing I can't do. I can warm up a bottle. Hey! Forget my... He's the one character in the game who doesn't have an accent, but you just gave him one. 
Well, that, well, it's, you didn't smell the diaper away. You're just gonna leave it there. Oh, Emily, are you hungry? Huh? You hold on. Happy trap, sir. I'm just. I wonder if you can. So you don't. It's probably like instant game. Don't over. choke, okay? <laughs> yeah, shove it. <laughs> Cause it's time for your feeding. Snake, how many times have I told you I don't want the bottle? Huh, who's a good cause? <laughs> Why do I do the things that I do? We need to get the guys who uh, voice cause and yes, let's snake. get let's get David Hayter and Robin Atkin Downs to just record them feeding cause. <laughs> Oh, Please tell me throw up job, on Emily. <sighs> You're feeling good. Throw up on him! Right? No. I'm gonna rock Don't the shake the baby. <laughs> that is not a thing. <laughs> Have you ever heard of shaking baby syndrome? That is what you want to avoid. I'm glad that the baby is, like, not ugly. Yes! How do you fail at that? <laughs> <Yeah>! Okay. <laughs> Seen that before. <laughs> I'm gonna kill this fucking baby. <laughs> I'm sorry. How do you fail at that? That might have been the funniest thing ever. Uh, oh yes, yes, we got the fucking baby. Yes. Yes. Sorry, kid. You're not done rocking, right? Hmm. Now I can't get the image of Snake rocking Cause to sleep out of my head. <laughs> he hasn't had a sleep roll. <laughs> Rock my Cause. Snake, tell me a good time, a good bedtime story. There was this one time I got shot in the face. <laughs> Hello. Thanks for looking after my baby. I didn't want to leave her. I just couldn't cope anymore. Just not having Jeremy around. He was such a good boy. Can't understand why anyone would want to hurt him. Do you take care of this baby on your own? Doesn't Jeremy's father live with you anymore? He disappeared. The day after Jeremy. I don't know what happened to him. Maybe... Maybe he couldn't take it. Ever since I've had to look after Emily all on my own and... I couldn't do it anymore. I understand. Did your husband say anything before he disappeared? Did he leave a note or something? No. He left the house without a word, and there was just the cell phone. A cell phone? Yeah, I, I found a cell phone in his dresser. I'm sure it wasn't his. I'd never seen it before. I tried to turn it on, but it didn't work. Do you still have it? Yeah, it's, uh, it's in a drawer in the living room. You can have it if you'd like. I'm sure it's of more use to you than to me. Do you have any family or anybody to help you? Yeah. My mother. I didn't want to ask her for anything. We don't really get along. 
but I guess I'm out of options. Well, look after yourself and Emily. I will, I promise. But, yeah, the fact that she was just going to kill herself and leave her kid to just, you know... Starve. Probably starve, yeah, that's really selfish. Like, what if Shelby didn't decide to come over? I know. Like, I'm assuming she had previous knowledge? But no. Shelby just shows up to these places. So she just was like, oh, hey, guy who saved my life. Yeah, she doesn't care. <laughs> yeah, drip it off. Hold on, listen. I'm gonna wake this fucking kid up. Good luck, Emily. You take care of your mom. You don't pet babies! That's not a thing. Well, I'm not gonna argue with Shelby, because so far he's my favorite character. Mm -mm. Yeah, Shelby's pretty awesome. I mean, he's a private eye. What isn't there he can't do? I know. Well, he can win your heart, you know? Yeah, uh, there's only one other man who's been able to win my heart. Ryan Gosling? Yep. I was gonna go with Hitler, but then I was like, no. How funny would it be if, like, it cuts back and she's dead again? <laughs> That's just finished herself off. <laughs> and blew her brains out. Yeah. I mean, literally, she blew her black brains out, her brains grew penis, and she blew herself. Mm hmm. And then. Yeah. That, uh, that makes sense. Okay, I'll do this Ethan part that we're done. <laughs> 